Most energy on Earth comes from the sun. Solar energy travels through the vacuum of space to Earth by a process called radiation. Radiation is energy emitted by an object, like light from a light bulb. Radiation happens at different wavelengths. The hotter the object is, the more energy it radiates at shorter wavelengths, from longest radio waves to shortest, highest energy gamma rays. Light bulbs can be used to illustrate the solar radiation that reaches Earth. Although the sun's peak output is at visible wavelengths, most solar energy reaches us as infrared radiation that we feel as heat. Think of the night lamp in a reptile cage. Next, we get hotter, higher energy shortwave radiation that we see as visible light and different colors at different wavelengths. A lesser amount of even higher energy ultraviolet radiation reaches us. Think of black lights and tanning beds. We can't see or feel UV radiation except by the damage it causes, such as sunburn and fading fabric. Luckily, our atmosphere protects us. In the stratosphere higher than Mount Everest, a gas called ozone acts like sunscreen and filters out most UV radiation so that even less reaches us at the surface. Most energy on Earth comes from solar radiation. We see the fraction that reaches Earth as visible light, we feel the infrared portion as heat, and we notice the harmful ultraviolet rays when we get a sunburn. For more information, visit climatebits.umd.edu.